So we've got tonight we've got Lada Borsch's Nuclear Winter. Had the family here the last couple of days helping do some stuff around the house. Uh, so I, I probably deserve a beer and um, I've been a little bit scared of this one, I don't mind admitting. 16% alcohol Brett Barley wine. Um, and I've got to drink it all myself. So no one that'll appreciate that kind of beer around here. Um, don't know what to think of it. Dark barley wine with Brett. I love Brett. Love a lot of Borscht, but... Ooh, on the nose. There's a really strong sort of dark, dark fruits, pums, prunes, raisins, sherry notes. You get some Brett leather character in there. Almost like an oaky astringency there as well. Whoa. Yeah, that's, that's a big beer. Um, chocolate, caramel, like dark caramel. Uh, sherry notes, plums, prunes, raisins. There's a real oakiness in there. I'm just, it must have been aged in barrels. It had to have been. There's just too much oak character. Alcohol is extremely well hidden. Uh, it's warming in the chest, but there's no way you pick it with such a big beer. Um, full body up front. Like uh, sweet malt up front, full body. Uh, the bread comes through in the aftertaste. Helps dry it out. The finish is actually surprisingly dry for such a big beer. There's real fruitiness in there. I think the uh, um, yeast esters, like a slight citrus character in there from the bread. Well, there's that little bit of leatheriness, but definitely the malt is what's on the showcase here. And the, um, what I'm perceiving is oak. I can't read French, so I've got no idea what it says. But anyway, our uh, carbonation is medium low, but it's a very, very easy drinking Brett barley wine. Like Brett can be a little bit challenging. There's a mild astringency in there. I think that comes from the oak. Um, yeah, if you if you're into Brett and you love barley wines, this one's a cracker. It's not heavy on the Brett. The barley wine is the hero. Brett's just a little bit of a um, assistant in the background. This is bloody delicious, but. Lot of Bosch, no surprise.